Hi, my name is Cormay, and in this video I'm going to be highlighting a Uyghur and website duo that makes playing augmentation and raid much more fluid. Basically what it does is it analyzes logs to come up with the best targets for you to buff in 27 second intervals. It pulls this from the WoW Analyzer, log analyzer, and then it helps you generate a note of who you should be buffing. The Uyghur, once you're in game, is also going to highlight in those 27 second intervals who you should be buffing ahead of time before the buff so you know who to push into for your upcoming Ebon Might. This takes a lot of like the thought and kind of like difficulty of playing Aug out of the game so that while you're playing you don't really have to think about who you're buffing and instead you can just focus more on your gameplay. Sight and Uyghur are really easy to use and it's probably the biggest draw to using this Uyghur compared to others like ABT which I also have a video on. In order to use this site all you need to do is go to the site Augmentator 3000, make sure at the top right you have the correct region selected and then you need to go and get your Warcraft log credentials. It's really easy, just go to the site, follow the instructions that are at the top of the page and then copy paste those in. After that you need to just get your logs. So you might have to make sure that, like, especially if you're like in a guild of private logs, you need to make sure that you're actually a part of the guild on Warcraft logs in order for you to use those logs. Alternatively you can just use your own logs and then it's not really a big deal and you don't have to go through that hassle. After you've gotten your credentials set up, you just want to paste in the log that you want to analyze. At the top, you can select the boss and difficulty that you want to analyze in case there's multiple bosses inside of the fight. And then below where it says do the magic, you hit the compute button. The very, very nice thing about this compared to the alternatives is it, it analyzes all of the wipes. So let's say that you're progging, like a lot of people right now are progging Ovenax and they're going to be progging Princess soon. So you have like multiple wipes on that instead of having to go through and look at each log individually it like conglomerates them all and analyzes them all at once and gives you the best possible list the other nice thing is that while you're going through prog once you put in the log for the night all you have to do is go and click this little refresh button like say like you wiped 10 more times you want to update it and make sure that you're getting the right targets get this little refresh button it changes the note all you need to do to get the note is go to the bottom and click the button that says copy notes. As for using the note, it's really simple. All you want to do is open WoW, go slash ART, go to your personal note, and then paste this in. And then you're going to have the Uyghur highlighting your targets throughout the fight. The target that's highlighted in red is going to be your most primary or best DPS target that you want to focus on buffing. As soon as you put prescience on this person, then the red target will switch and it makes it really easy for you to know who your next priority in buffing is. So again, this Uyghur, this site, everything is really simple to use. The next thing I'm going to do is basically compare this to the other Uyghur that I highlighted and made another video on a couple of weeks ago, which is called ABT. Both of them use WoW Analyzer to generate their notes. However, both of them kind of have a varying ability to customize. So I'm going to start with the things I like more about Augmentator 3000 first, since that's what this video is about. The biggest thing that I do like about it is that when you are progging, there is just that little refresh tool. It's pulling from all of your wipes to create the note. And it's also super easy to use, not only for when you're progging, but also when you're on farm. So it actually saves like all of your logs on the site. Like once you go on the site once, every time you revisit, it still has your logs there and it still has all of your old notes. So that whenever you're going back on farm, you can just go back to the notes you had before and just hit copy paste instead of keeping something like a word doc like the notes that you want especially if you're like changing out the players that are in your raid that could get really frustrating so those are the things i like about augmentator 3000 i think it's definitely more user easy friendly compared to abt but it does lack the customization that abt has so the nice thing about abt is that it comes with a spreadsheet so the biggest problem with these 27 second intervals and i talked about this in the other video if you wanted to use that one the easy way is that it's just not realistic especially when you are playing things like imminent destruction with breath of aeons and lusting on pole that ebon might like as soon as you press breath of aeons and a couple of eruptions inside your imminent destruction it's definitely lasting more than 27 seconds and it's really hard after that to know that you're actually buffing the optimal targets when you can only do these intervals on 27 seconds there's no way currently on the augmentator 2000 site that i've been able to find that you can change these intervals. Again, it's just pulling from WoW Analyzer and WoW Analyzer only has the capability by default to do the 27 second intervals. Now with the ABT Uyghur, you can use a spreadsheet. Hello, you can set your own intervals in order to do that. And there's ways you can manipulate WoW Analyzer when you're looking at a single log in order to look at inter different intervals than the ones it does by default. And also just to look at logs and make your own note and feel like it's more accurate. So. In my opinion, if you were just not super wanting to optimize, put in a lot of time 
this is a really good option to just use the Augmentator 3000. However, if you are kind of like a perfectionist type of player and you want it to be perfect and you want like the right intervals and do the most DPS, I think I would still suggest using ABT in the spreadsheet even though it is a lot more work. I think that both, either way, if you've just been kind of playing like a guessing game, or just for, like relying on Omni CD, or just like doing whatever, like just only buffing like the BM Hunters and Enhanced Shamans because like those are the ones you always know have DPS. I think if that's the boat you fall into, no matter which one you pick, you're going to do the most DPS. And if you're in that boat, then I would suggest you just use this Augmentator 3001 because again, it is very, very simple to use and very user friendly. And I look forward to using it on farm myself. Yeah, that's everything I have to say. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.